hey what's going on guys welcome to my channel and today's in this video we are going to cover how to boost your fps fix fps drops and stutters in all the game with your any low end pc or laptop and also guys with that most people are watching my video without even subscribing so guys please make sure to subscribe drop a like on this video and also comment anything in the comment section of my this video because it's support and motivate me for making more content for you so guys with this thing in time let's dive straight into it so guys in the very first step we are going to disable the memory compression on our windows that is causing uh, the high memory usage in the background and causing the stutters and fps drops so guys for that you need to go for your windows search and search for power shell and make sure to run this as administrator once you run this as administrator now you need to use here the same command and that is very easy now you need to type here mm agent and press enter and you will find out here this kind of the interface like here we got our memory compression and right now it is on the uh, true and it is turned on and guys you need to turn off the settings or disable the settings right now because by default it is on the true so guys how you can do it it is very simple you need to simply type here disable now type minus again type mm agent now space then again minus and type mc that is memory compression now press enter guys that's it now for checking again these results again type mm agent and press enter and guys right now it is on to the fourth but you need to restart your pc for taking effect the settings on your pc so guys after restarting pc now the next step you need to download these two files on your pc that is the empty standby list for fixing the stutters and fps drops while you gaming and next here we got ultimate windows tweaker.zip file and you can guys grab these both files from my discord server simply join my discord server link in the description go for download tab and there you will find out this ultimate windows tweaker 4 and guys you can simply search in the search bar of the discord for finding this exe file click on the download button and download this file on your pc now the very first step for the empty standby list cleaner you need to right click here go for properties go for compatibility and make sure to check mark onto the run this program as an administrator then hit apply and click ok after that you need to create here a new folder name it anything like you can type here uh, Hassan's uh, windows tweaking and press enter now you need to simply put this application or exe file into this folder now right click here click on the cut and move this folder open up your file explorer go for your uh, c drive and simply paste it here now once you paste it here now you need to close out this file explorer now go for windows search and search for task scheduler and open up task scheduler on your pc so guys now the next step you need to create here a task so simply go for create task button now you need to name it anything like i'm typing here empty standby list by persons and guys that's it now you need to go for the next step that is the change a user or group go for this option now go for advance now click on the find now button now scroll down and there you will find out the system option click here and click ok once you add here the system file now click on this ok button and guys that's it and check mark onto the one with highest privileges after that guys go for the next tab that is the trigger now go for new so guys now you need to go for advanced settings simply check mark onto this option which is the repeat delay check mark here yeah, now you need to set it on to the five minutes after that go for four hour duration and set it on to the indefinitely because every five minutes this will automatically run this program and clean all the standby memory of your windows now check mark onto the enable and after that click onto the ok button now you then now you need to go for the next action tab go for new now click on the browse option now go for your local disk c and find out here the folder which we just created and that is Hassan's windows tweaking open up the folder select this exe file and click on the open button now click ok again hit ok again so guys here we got empty standby list by Hassan's and guys after that now close out task manager now in the next step guys here we got windows ultimate tweakers open up the zip file using the sound zip or the winrar and drag this folder on your desktop Open up this folder inside here you will find out this exe file so make sure to run this as administrator for having the full access on your windows now guys in the very first step here we got all the system information so i have windows 10 pro version and here is my i5 12 gen interprocessors after that here is my 16 gb of the ram so guys now let's go for the optimization and for that you need to go for this performance tab and there you will find out this performance tweaks option so guys now from here you will find out some default settings so simply don't change the default settings and guys here on the right side you will find disable tablet input service check mark on this box 
After that, you will find disable prefetch services, check mark here. Disable super fetch services, check mark here. Disable printer spoiling services, check mark here. And disable Microsoft Edge preloading, also check mark on this box. After that, click on the apply button and apply these tweaks. Now click OK. Now you need to go for the next step that is the security and the privacy. And there you will find disable registry editor, disable control panel, task manager, and a lot of other stuff. But guys, you do not need to do anything because this is the important services. Now you need to go for this window section and there you will find out disable explorer, menu, context, check mark here, disable windows error reporting, turn off user tracking, disable windows mobility center, and disable OneDrive. After that, click on the apply button and apply these tweaks on your PC. Now on the next step, go for the privacy tab. There you will find out disable telemetry, disable and reset advertisement ID. Simply check mark on all these boxes. Also check mark on the disable Cortana. Disable app access to the camera. Disable app access to the messages. And then here you will find out calendar and uh, microphone settings. Simply uh, uncheck these boxes, but check mark on all these boxes. After that, click on the apply button and apply these tweaks on your PC. So guys, once you set up all the settings on your PC, now on the next step, we are going to optimize our Windows in build settings. So guys, for that, go for your Windows start icon and open up your Windows settings. Now you need to go for update and security and there you will find out this delivery optimization. Go for this option. Make sure to turn on the settings because this will use the internet while you're playing Fortnite or any other game on your PC. And that is causing the high ping and packet loss issue. After that, guys, now you need to go back into the home tab. Now you need to go for privacy. Turn off all these general settings. Now go for diagnostic and feedback. Also make sure to turn off all the settings from here. Now go for activity and history. Uncheck these boxes and clear all the previous history. Now you need to go for camera if you are not using the camera. So make sure to turn it off. Now you need to go for next step. That is the uh, privacy or the background app section. Go for it and make sure to turn off all the background apps. Now go for app diagnostic. Turn off the settings from here. Go for documents. Also make sure to turn off the documents from here. Now again go for home button and guys now this time go for system settings. Now you need to scroll down, go for advanced display settings. There guys you need to choose here your gaming monitor and make sure to use always the highest refresh rate supported by your monitor. So guys I have already selected 240Hz, now you need to go back. Scroll down, go for graphic settings and turn off hardware accelerated GP scheduling. Turn on this option from here. And now you need to go for the next settings that is the graphics performance preference. Now you need to go for browse and add here your all the games available on your PC. Go for that specific game and set it on the high performance. Do the same settings for all your available game on your PC and that will help to improving your FPS, fixing FPS drops and stutters while you gaming on your any when PC or laptop. I hope so you love this video. Please make sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel and until the next video, peace out.